there's a couple of different options. The Tedeschi book actually recommends hanging it over your thumb and then it flips up into your palm. I actually find that it's really hard to control when you're spinning. You have to kind of latch onto it. So the guys on YouTube that I've been seeing hang it over your bottom three fingers with your forefinger out. And then when it spins around it up and over the back, it comes right to your palm. You kind of have to choose which way you're going to do it and set your cord for that length. So you can see that that's how I've, I've set mine. So it's hanging over my bottom three fingers, with my forefinger out of the loop, and it slings over into the hand. So that's really convenient <clears throat> from a drawing perspective. If it's in your belt, it's super easy actually to grab it with those three fingers. Just jab it into the loop, and then you can strike with the draw coming out here, strike across the opponent's face, and then it slings right around the hand, right around back up into your hand. So I know I've been, probably you have been too, we've been practicing this a bunch, so it looks, it's starting to look actually a little bit easy. Sling it out and it comes right to the hand. So do it slow, especially if you're working with a, with a wooden stick. Uh, don't bash yourself in the face, but just practice that draw first and let it flop. Just let it flop. Just practice with the technique of drawing it with your three fingers, striking across where an opponent's face would be, and then putting it back, doing that some more. And just let it flop, don't worry about trying to catch it. Once you're comfortable with that, you feel like your accuracy is pretty good, let that cord, let that stick flip out and around, and it flips right back up into your hand. So the whole drill we were doing the other night that I thought was pretty helpful. And Master Curry added the draw on that. I don't know, I don't know why I didn't think of that, but it was a good add. So we start with the draw, strike across the face, flip it up and capture the stick. <clears throat> the next piece of the drill is flipping that stick out of the hand, up over the back of the hand. You're capturing the, the cord, slinging across the face here, and then recapturing it on this side. Frame a little bit. So it looks like this, just from a draw, strike into your hand, back out, strike into your hand. I'm not frame on this over just a little bit. Strike into your hand, strike into your hand. I dropped it that time, my thumb got in the way. Strike into your hand, strike into your hand. <clears throat> and then when I first came up with this drill, I was just saying strike across and then back to the beginning here. Strike across, back to the beginning here. Strike across, back to the beginning here. Strike across, back to the beginning here. We haven't really talked about this except for Master Curry on 